Thanks for coming and joining me in the video. I want to show you a really useful feature of the key editor and the drum editor inside of Cubase, which you've probably overlooked. Here inside of the key editor, there's a button at the very top in the toolbar called Pitch Visibility. And when we turn this on, what's going to happen is all of the notes that don't contain any MIDI data will be hidden from view like so, giving you an overview of what's being used and also show you the notes that the MIDI is on. Now in the drum editor, it's exactly the same story. If we click on this button, it will hide all of the stuff that does not contain any MIDI data. And what's useful about this as well is that if you do need to rename any of these, it's easy to do so because you can just click on the instrument to rename it. So for example, this could be a snare drum for this library for all I know. Um, so you'd listen to it and then you can come in and rename it and sort out the map for it. So hopefully you found this useful. Thanks for coming and I'll see you all in the next Cubase Tips video.